event, one fall, 15 minute time limit. In the ring at this time, wrestling premier manager, Gary Hart, present from the Queens, New York City, 287 pounds, the Dingo Warrior. And entering the ring at this time from Dallas, Texas, 247 pounds, outstanding, popular, Lance Von Erich. Rick Hazard, your referee. What a uh, blockbuster night we're having tonight. Not to mention next week, tonight. Great bout to kick things off. The interview with Percy and now Lance Von Erich versus the Dingo. And this is indeed a battle of the bill. I want to talk a little as this bout gets started about yesterday. You've heard me mention the jam-packed crowd. Over 8,000 in the beautiful new Mesquite Arena. A great day for all. From all of us at World Class Championship Wrestling, thank you again for being with us. We hope that we could repay a little of our debt to you with uh, the many extras that went along with that great card. Well, anyway, the bout between Abdullah the Butcher and Bruiser Brody was even more than anyone dreamed it would be. I have never seen Gary Hart so vicious and so aggressive. He's obviously fitting so confident with Abdullah the Butcher, who was also vicious and aggressive. It was unpredictable, unexpected, it was scary, it was wild, it was exciting. In the ring, on the edge of the ring, outside the ring. And of course, there were those controversial objects used. Toward the end of the bout, it was getting so dangerous that David Manning came to the ring to try to get Gary Hart to stop what he was doing, just making things worse, interfering. David wound up getting hurt. I had hoped to talk with him tonight, but we can't do that. David was thrown down and uh, mildly injured. Bruiser Brody followed Gary Hart and Abdullah the Butcher away. It wound up under one of the big rodeo gates in the north end of that Mesquite Arena, which is very large. There was no winner. It has not been settled, and Monday night, perhaps it will be settled. You owe it to yourself to be here. I'll talk more about this later. I cannot ignore this bout any longer. Lance Von Erich versus Bruiser Brody. Lance Von Erich versus Bruiser. Lance versus the Dingo Warrior. I've got Bruiser in the mind. And there's a drop kick from behind. And Gary Hart rushes to the aid of his Dingo. Lance and Dingo with similar builds. This Dingo, uh, an awesome individual. Never been knocked off his feet being coached by one of the world's, if not the world's finest manager, Gary Hart. And when I say finest, I didn't say popular, I said uh, finest, because he does have a great ability when it comes to teaching individuals. Whether or not it's teaching them what to do or what they really shouldn't be doing, that remains to be decided, but he is a good teacher. Look at the muscles flexing on the Dingo Warrior with strands of orange around the biceps. And the struggle here with Lance Von Erich, the Von Erich cousin, who was sensational in that big six-man bout in Mesquite last Sunday. Dingo with the painted face, a very mysterious but awesome individual. And we have not seen the best of him yet. Look at him looking down at Lance Von Erich as Gary Hart very quietly and patiently watches from ringside. Lance leaps across, Dingo returns. Lance wanted to hook him, but the Dingo turns him around, drops the elbow, but Lance was out of the way. Lance now getting the fans to cheer as he bars the arm. Texas title Friday night in Dallas. Buzz Sawyer defending against Steve Simpson. This dingo warrior who's down in the middle of this now faces Kevin Von Erich. And Monday night would be worth the price of a ticket if it were just the one match. But add those other great bouts to that Butcher Brody bout and you've really got excited. Watch the hair now by the dingo. Lance dropping the knees. I've got big news about Labor Day during the television main event coming next as Dingo has to have his hand pulled away by Rick Hazard. Big news about Labor Day and a special treat for you. 
I'll talk about that during our television main event. Gary Hart complaining to referee Rick Hazard. Lance Von Erich in charge. Dingo shoves him back into the corner. There's Gary Hart. Keep your eye on him. Ooh, we heard that one, and we heard that too. Listen to those. To the corner. The dingo stops like a gorilla, bangs the chest, but he waited too long, and Lance took a breather and got out of the way. Lance back takes the arm over the head, over the head again. Lance twisting, turning. Like I say, Bruiser Brody last Sunday was up in one of the bull shoots. He and Abdullah had it there, heart in the middle of everything. Brody pinned up in the big uh, shoots back there, the railings around them. Five minutes. If you were a part of that jam-packed crowd, you'll know what I'm talking about. Lance ducks under, comes back, flying body press. But they were over in the ropes and no count took place. And the dingo dumps Lance to the floor. The enthusiastic fans looking on. They're over that rope. Dingo jerks the rope away. Gary Von Erich says hello to everybody who could not be with us last Sunday. Lance is thrown. Big clothesline knocks Lance off his feet. Great to see Kerry come out. I want to thank everybody for backing off and giving Kerry the chance to come out. We were watching that foot. Didn't run it to get stepped on. Bingo raises Lance high. Drops him over the knee with the back over the knee. Bingo stays on him. Back rope. Near side rebound. Lance is in the midst of a dingo bear hug. Lance has got to be hurting in the midst of the dingo squeeze. The big squeeze is on to the dingo. He won about on a submission at the Sportatorium a couple of weeks ago with this very same bear hugging hold. Lance trying to hang in there. Bats the head with a right. Gary complaining about a closed fist. The Dingo still holding on like the awesome man he is. And finally, Lance bats himself out with streaks of orange across his face, rubbing off from that of the Dingo. Lance Von Erich returns and goes over the knee. Talking about Kerry yesterday, Kerry felt a little bit guilty that he was not physically able to get with the fans and sign some autographs. That will be different on Labor Day. I'll talk about that, as I said, during the TV main event. Dingo turns him over and drops him, now backs off into the corner. Dingo! And Lance rolls to his left. And the dingo hits. Lance Von Eric and the dingo now standing toe to toe in this struggle. The Von Erichs, the superstars of pro wrestling, coast to coast and around the world. But Gary Hart trying to derail.